From the heart of Texas, this is Central Texas News Now. Good evening. Here's a look at your top stories. Hurricane Dorian passed by Puerto Rico without making landfall, but the storm is now on track to hit the United States and Florida's bracing for a hit. The storm is expected to strike the Sunshine State as a category four hurricane. In addition to hurricane force winds, forecasters say there could be more than a foot of rain dumped by the storm. And cruisers lined the parking lot to say their final farewell to Nathan Sodek this morning. The Marlin police chief died by suicide last week. Dozens gathered at the Vista Community Church today in Temple to remember the life of the 30 year old. Now it's time for a check on your first alert forecast with Matt. Thanks, Lindsay. And let's take a look at that forecast. We are not dealing with any hurricanes around here, and that is good news. So it's going to be a little toasty from time to time. Highs will be in the mid to upper 90s with a 20% chance of a storm on Friday, 30% Saturday, and 20% again Sunday. Labor Day looks dry. Most of next week does as well, with highs remaining in the 90s. The Central Texas News Now News app. Search KXXV in your app store.